there hasn't been anything like this since the Diablo mobile game reveal. So when this car stepped onto the stage, the world split into two. It's been almost two years since Cybertruck was revealed to the world. Everybody stood in silence, then laughed at it, then thought for more than a minute, and then everything changed. Cybertruck, as it was presented in November of 2019, is going to disrupt the pickup truck industry as we know it. There are two main and many smaller reasons why Cybertruck is both crazy and amazing. We are going to talk about exactly those two reasons in this video. We are pretty sure you've seen the memes. You might have made some memes by yourself. This is indeed a car that we can draw flawlessly. The thing about Cybertruck is its uniqueness. We're also pretty sure that you already figured that out, but hear me out. You might not like it, you may love it, but either way, you can't deny that it is different. In his book, How Things Become Popular, Derek Thompson wrote the following quote, To sell something familiar, make it surprising. To sell something surprising, make it familiar. Did the light bulb just turn on in your head? Exactly. Cybertruck is something that we are all familiar with. Well, at least Americans are familiar with it. Pick up trucks are part of American culture at this point, so when Musk and his friends sat down to discuss this possible idea of an all-electric pickup truck, we can be sure that somebody said this quote. Not only that, we can be sure that this quote was the guiding principle. Not everybody might like it, but you can be sure that everybody knows what a Cybertruck is. That was Elon's goal. Speaking of the look of Cybertruck, one really important feature of this truck is not as clear as some of its other features. Normally, pickup trucks are the least fuel-efficient and aerodynamic modes of transportation there are. Most trucks are like a moving cube, but not Cybertruck. That easy and small bend that makes it easy to draw is also responsible for making Cybertruck one of the most aerodynamic trucks ever. That simple fact gives Cybertruck a lot more range and a lot less drag. One moment you are making fun of this thing, and a moment later you realize that the form it has can be responsible for the 500-mile range that it has. That is about 100 miles more compared to the competition. That's 25% of the overall range. The fact that it looks like a four-year-old's drawing makes it better than its competitors. That is mind-boggling. The range has always been one of the biggest problems when it came to electric cars, but there aren't many situations where you'll need more than 500 miles of range for any type of camping trip. A very simple yet very neat look gives Cybertruck another advantage. It is like an empty canvas. You can probably already see different versions of Cybertruck. That immense customizability is because of the truck's simple design. This gives many different people many different ideas of what Cybertruck is for them. That, my friend, is preferred. While Ford F-150 has just one form, normal pickup truck form, Cybertruck is in a league of its own. There are concepts from Cybertruck sedan, sports car, house, armored car for the army, and so on. The possibilities are endless when it comes to this new style. If Cybertruck becomes popular enough, people might consider buying more than one of these, and use one as it is, and transform the other into something jaw-droppingly genius, like this. Wouldn't you like to have something as crazy as that? Well, if not you, many other people will. People going around in cars like that will make the whole Cybertruck Cybertruck meme even bigger, and hence the popularity of Cybertruck will grow even more, driving more sales, and at some point it will become a positive feedback loop where making fun of Cybertruck means more sales for Tesla. Then there is yet another amazing advantage that comes with being simple. The simpler the construction, the easier it is to make it. The easier something is to make, the cheaper it costs, unless you are greedy. See, even though Cybertruck has many qualities of a tank, one of those being basically an indestructible exoskeleton that is made from stainless steel, it is still cheap. Yes, $40,000 might seem a lot, but then you remember it having a dent-resistant body and bullet-resistant glass, and then it does not seem that expensive. When the steel will be shipped to a factory, the more times it's required to be bent, the more time it takes. And as you know, time is money. By having just one long steel chunk just slightly bent, Cybertruck saves a lot of money and still manages to be liked by many. Would you like to have a tank for 40 grand? We definitely would. So that sheer badassness, versatility, and relative cheapness, compared to being a tank-like thing, Cybertruck does everything perfectly to go deep into your subconscious mind and make that its home. How many videos, blogs, and memes have you seen where it starts with, this is the worst thing ever, and then gradually turns into, I want to have it? That is the goal of Tesla. I don't know how often you think about the psychology behind something, but Cybertruck is indeed something that is actively influencing your mind. That is a good thing for a company that does not pay a penny for advertising. Because 
pickup trucks are the most popular cars in the United States, it was likely that Tesla would eventually approach that niche and try to turn it upside down. Cybertruck has not been available for us to buy yet, so we don't know if it will fulfill its purpose, but the ingredients are there. See, when you are creating a product, you have to make it at least as good as the competitor to have the chance of actually becoming a competitor to somebody. In that case, either your price must be lower so you win that way, or the quality must be higher, or the brand has to be more deep-rooted into people. There are many ways to think if something is valuable. For a product like a truck, it is much like pants. It can be valuable if it is comfortable, it can be valuable if it is high fashion, and it can be valuable if it is useful, has a lot of pockets for example, and pants can achieve perfection when it is all three of those. Pickup trucks are just like pants. So is Cybertruck comfortable? It is big, any Scandinavian can fit into it without any trouble, so that's a yes. Is it high fashion? Technically no, it is literally the reverse of a standard that we are so familiar with, but fashion changes. We believe that is what Elon is counting on, so let's call that a maybe. And is it useful? Is it at least as good as its competitor? That is a bit harder question to answer since it hasn't been available to buy just yet, but if we compare the stats that Elon provided to us to Ford F-150, we can clearly see the answer. The range is about the same, but when it comes to a maximum payload and maximum towing force, Cybertruck is clearly on top of its game. While 0-60 to 60 might not be an important aspect of any truck, it really makes it badass when you know that your 6,000-pound tank can go up to 60 miles an hour in 2.9 seconds. That just sounds unreal and extremely badass at the same time. When we first found out about the guy named Elon Musk, the most crucial part of his ideas was when he talked about the first principle. The first principle is a way of reasoning that is extremely useful when you are trying to solve a problem. The real genius of Cybertruck is that it is designed from beginning to the very end by using the first principle's way of thinking. We talked a lot about form in this video, but form follows the function. It does not even have mirrors, and many people have asked if that was even legal. It might not be legal, but it is certainly not needed when you have better cameras than many big businesses. This small example perfectly captures the way it was designed. They sat down, thought about it, used the first principles method, and arrived at the conclusion that, you know what, it doesn't need mirrors, and that way of design is what made me love this truck. With that, we firmly believe that we gave you more than two good reasons why Cybertruck's actually much better as a whole than you think. Please hit that like button if you like this video, and expect more of these kinds of videos in the future. To not miss any of those videos, you might consider subscribing to Tech Division, which we would very much appreciate. Thank you for watching, and we will meet you in the next video. Until then, have an interesting and beautiful day.